I think this is my 93rd mural, and uh, maybe only my maybe my ninth in the States. So most of them are not currently in the States. Definitely the first in Mississippi, which is awesome. It initially started for me as a meditation, just painting. My initiative is to make everyone talk about elephants. Art is a really good way to communicate without actually trying to. It's just a way to communicate an emotion. What I'm trying to teach through my art is, as I mentioned, love and compassion, but also why elephants shouldn't be ridden, why they shouldn't perform tricks. For me, making an impact, that's the victory. Raising money for elephant conservation groups, that's great, it's amazing. Being able to speak for them, they're too busy doing the work, they're taking care of the animals, they're rescuing them, and the process for that is brutally difficult. And I laugh because I'm like, people are like, thank you, and I'm like, no, 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 I'm just painting elephants on walls. Like, there are people out there doing it. I, you should thank them. It's amazing to see how elephants bring out the best in people. Animals, obviously, are a beautiful connective tissue between people and, you know, their heart. And uh, I feel like a lot of people reach out to me and they say, you know, I don't know why, but I just, I love elephants. And I love that. Uh, I think elephants speak to us. A lot of times I try to explain, like, there's no mistakes in art. It's an opportunity. So whether you're a musician, a poet, a writer, uh, you create. And sometimes you have to step away from your own fear. And so the greatest thing for me to teach children is, is that uh, it doesn't matter what you're going to say as long as you say it. And step away from the judgment of that statement. Just do it. 